Miguel and Ronnie Deep here in the iBob Vault. So we're going to hit you with some boxing odds. We've got a boxing video blog going down here the first week of February. We've got some odd odds popping up for Thursday, the 4th of February, and Friday, the 5th. The fights on Thursday coming to us from Bangkok, Thailand. you got the WBC minimum weight title in, on the line, the world title there. It's an interim version, but we've got a rematch going down between Knockout Fresh Smart, obviously the sponsor name, the TIE fighter there. Uh, he took the belt, he's 11-0, and, and he took the belt from Carlos Butrigo of uh, Nicaragua back in 2014. Butrigo, 28-1-1, one one, only loss in his career is to Fresh Smart. He's coming back to try to win his belt. Fresh Smart, a minus 190 favorite. Butrigo at plus 150. Over-under on the 12-rounder is set at 9.5 with the overpay minus 300 and the under at plus 220. Interesting rematch there. Minimum weight world championship on the line. Other end of the spectrum, you're heading over to Europe. You've got the heavyweights in Monaco. And you got Johan de Hoopas. De Hoopas obviously was uh, in his last fight, went uh, and fought WBC world champion Deontay Wilder. Wilder knocked him out late in the fight. De Hoopas still a very good record, 32 and 3. Bouncing back, there's a bounce back fight for him. He's fighting veteran Marcelo Luis Nascimento. Nascimento, plus 2,000 underdog with the hoop is at minus 5,000 on the return there. And uh, heading over to the United States, also Friday night, you got the Fancy Springs Casino, Golden Boy Promotions is there. They got a couple of their undefeated prospects, uh, future up-and-comers on this card as headliners. They're in crush fights, huge lines on these. But you got undefeated 19-0, welterweight Frankie Gomez, minus 2,000 favorite in his fight over Silverio Ortiz. And you got former IBF Bantamweight champion moving up to Super Bantamweight. You got Randy Cavallero, huge, minus 8,500 favorite over Ruben Garcia. Garcia paying back plus 3,500. Those are the odds coming up for the early part of the weekend, first week of February. I'm Miguel Dorado, and we'll talk to you after the fights.